Hello, hello, good afternoon, everybody. Mel and Tony. Ah, right here under the tree. Mel. Hey, Tony. Dr. Fernando, what do you say? <laughs> Things good? Everything good. You sure? Yeah. You got, you got any say to me? You want to say anything to me? No, just happy Sabbath. Eh? Yes. Saturday, happy Sabbath. Happy Sabbath. You, you find this man yet? Yeah? Wow. Why are you looking for I'm looking for a man. Eh? I, I, you got your hair, dude. So you, I, I, I do my hair for me. Yeah, What's wrong with you? No, y'all women is do y'all hair for man, for mm. me, and and all them fellas. Listen, anyhow, I can find you a man. If that, you, 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 you saying the same thing. God got you favored. I, I, you hear me mention God? I, you, I straight. You straight? I straight. How straight? Leave Perfectly. this alone. Perfectly. Perfectly. Perfectly straight. Wonderfully yeah. made. I know that's what you're gonna say, but I, I got a man for you. I got a man. I, got, I want you to marry a man who will, who will be in charge. What my topic today is? What our topic is again? Who's the boss? Two boss, one relationship. Two boss, one relationship. We can know today now. I thought you were gonna say something about the V. But anyhow, I got some stuff to clean up before. I, I get don't know why you like to mess around me. You can get a surprise one of these. One of these days, eh? Well. You must see, you must see your uh, sweet your husband dead. You must see your uh, sweet. My husband, yeah, my husband dead. Yeah, yeah. you must see your sweet. Anyway, sorry for saying your husband dead. Anyway, folks, uh, I show you the day. You're all right now, then. I know you're ready. I got you. You're ready. That's all I was gonna set you up. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Anyway, I hope you're ready. I ready, man. I ready. But anyway, folks, let me say this. You saw man. Let me say this, folks. I got some things to clean up. We talking about. One relationship with two boss. Yeah. With two boss. Or and, is there two? Or is there two? Mm -hmm. And I had a conversation earlier with this with this woman, but I can I can let you know what I thought telling me with the same thing I haven't. But anyhow, I gotta clean up some stuff. First I take but about two minutes to clean up some stuff. First of all, I wanna I wanna talk about where I came from. It's a place called Montel Heights. Well, what happened? Montalice exploded this week with all the killing. Mm -hmm. um, you little punks who are running around there now, listen to me. Listen to me. I come from Montalice. You all know me. I ain't no stranger. You know I love Montalice. Now you better stop your nonsense. That foolishness you all doing, cut that all, that all from day. Now, what all them situation, but who was best friend? And we do this together, and this this happened, and this one pimp on this one, and this one, and this one sleeping with this one girl, all that crap. And the only way you can solve it is kill one another. I cease from the day. I come in in Mandel Heights tomorrow, day after tomorrow. I've been there a couple of days, but I come in there, and I can stop to every door, because you all know me. And I's the gatekeeper. And we ain't doing this. We, we ain't doing that. That stopped today. So now I can call on some few people who mow hard and a few people who know what to do. Because we've been here before. Mandalay's been here plenty of time before. I heard that Carlos Reed, you been there. Carlos, you born in Ridgeland Park, but you started your gang banging in Mandalay. You know that. From Lola back in the day. I been there with you. So let me tell you something, Gallus. I appreciate you, I love you, and I want you to know you were the first one there, and I appreciate that. And so kudos to you. But we got some brothers I ain't see. Let me tell you all. So let me send a message to these brothers. This is who I'm sending to. Pastor Raymond Wells, you. I calling all y'all out. And let me tell you why I call you old Pastor Raymond Wells. Because you know Mountain Lights better than everybody else. Pastor Ferguson. You all grow, grow, hang out. Your, when you all was on doing your all drugs and when you all was selling drugs in Mountain Lights. All of you all is pastor now. And the past is the past. But I ain't see you yet. Pastor Ferguson. Pastor um, uh, uh, Raymond Wells' brother, Wells on the hill. I see 
Neil Ellis, you see, you tell everybody you're from Bimini. But you know you used to live in Sister Dawkins' house. And you used to play basketball with me. Neil Ellis, I call you, you say retire now. So now, we in crisis. We don't need you, we ain't want no money from you. The very neighborhood you enjoy your practice and enjoy your good life now, and we move out. I, I need you back to walk through that place and start talking to these people because we got to stop this murder foolishness. All right? And all, all the fellas, Dr. Johnson, all of you, where are you? Listen, I count on you all to support me. We need to get, go back and put this, this little gang thing stop. Stop. We did it before. So this ain't like me, it's nothing new. We did this before. We walked the streets before and calm it down and clean it up a little bit. So we could do it again. And I calling on y'all, all of y'all, all of y'all who left and gone and who, who, who don't want to claim the crew know who I talking about. For God's sake, we gotta stop this. Because you know how it go. You all know how it go. It's for you know they ain't end there. Until we intervene, we gotta intervene. So all Robert Taylor, all I call an all of y'all. Let's get together and let's put a stop to this wave, murder wave, right as we speak. And I call on y'all. Froggy, Ojin, Sam, all the senior men, all your OGs back in the put talk let's talk to these little boys and calm this down. Alright? Ken. Have my condolences for your son. But you one of them too. We need we need to start talking to these kids. Whatever it is, I don't care if it's how you should against Bahamian. I don't care what it is. Bahamian. Let's put a stop to this. Alright? That's what I can say to that mother like the saga. All of us I count on y'all. Let's get together and let's put a stop to this. Moving right along. Today. The day I they rest like a brother to me, a mentor to me, Rodney Johnson. And um, we went to the funeral today, and we we really had a good time. And 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 what is amazing, a woman pastor, a woman priest, whatever they call them in the uh, Anglican Church, what is called priest. priest, a woman priest. I was shocked and amazed, but I know they have them, but I was shocked and amazed, and she was pretty good. And so, she sent a charge out of whatever we have against our brother man. We need to apologize. Same thing I talk about, we need to apologize and let that be and move on. And, and, and be men now, we gotta be men. And we gotta start putting love back in the whole thing. And then afterwards we went by my good friend, cabbage and um, we had a good all the referees get together and we had a good time and we sit down and had a good to me it's like a fellowship all us to see all us back together all us in one and, and, and enjoying it it was beautiful and I, I was shocked the amount of people the referees that turned out to this film Rodney Johnson May I rest his soul in peace. And our topic today is, this is today the Lord had made us, let us rejoice and gladden it. No, that's not it. All right. All right, we can get to our show right now. And I met an interesting lady today. And, and she, she was looking pretty and smiling, sitting right there, enjoying us, having a good time. And she said, oh, you got a, yeah, she'd be surprised I have a little show. And she was sitting there. And she says she can f follow us today. Yeah, she can follow us from now on. Okay. And so that's a good little plus. And so we had a good, we got a good little time. And um, and uh, and women came out, men came out. We had a good old time, a good old fellowship, and everybody together. And Rodney was like a mentor, you know. He was a little, little rough on the edges sometime, but that's people. You accept them where they are. And, and, and in a beautiful relationship 
That's what we're talking about today. You mm -hmm. got to accept people where they are. See, but your old woman, yeah, the, yeah, it come. Your old woman won't be the boss all the time. So what about men accepting women? No, where they we are? are the boss. You all won't be the boss. You don't get this thing mixed up. You all want to be the boss, but you all, we, many of you all are not prepared to lead. And one thing, women have a serious problem following after a man who don't know his head from his toe. When we try to be strong. Being strong. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. When we take charge then of our relationship, you all don't like it. You all say we too, too harsh, too strong, too, too, you know. Oh, you too like to be controlled. You all the man like to be in charge. <clears throat> Listen to me. When we do, we damn. When we don't, we damn. But you all won't be the boss. All the time. Wow, you all catching a 2020, and they call the catch 20 situation. Damn if you do, damn if you don't. Well, see, we, something woman miss, you know. Something woman miss. Tell us. Let me tell you what y'all miss. God told you what? To be a helpmate to me. Help? Eat, you had a word? Meat. meat. You had a word? The help. first word is help. help. Yeah. But y'all expect the meat without the help. Explain what you're talking about. Because we're supposed to be helping you all, but y'all leave everything to us. So that's why we feel comfortable taking charge because. Who go to the grocery store? Who do the laundry? Who do all the cooking? Who take care of the children? That sounds like boss, eh? You, you all won't do that. Really, Tony? Nobody tell. See, le let, me, let me let me break this down so you get it. See, I won't break this down. And I, and I want my... I, I know I got a couple of women watching this because, you know, they, they try to play it. But I want you to listen to this good. And I come in straight up with this. As a man, my job is simple. My job is to abide and take care of you. According to who? The Bible. Really? Yeah. My, that's my job. Really? Yeah. Your job is to, to nurture help and keep me. Meet. Help me. Help me. Help me. Meet your responsibility. So, yeah, you are yeah. responsible. Yeah. Help me to be strong. So that means help you me. should be helping with all the things that the women do too. No, 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 no. See, I, I can break it down for you. I when you get oh, no, 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 slow down. I tell listen to the words I use now. I don't miss it. I ain't tell you go get a maid. You gonna get a maid, right? Keep talking. So you should pay for that, right? You go <laughs> But what the maid doing hold in on, the hold house? Hold on, hold on. What is the maid doing? She cleaning doing? for you. Really? No, she ain't cleaning Because me. I supposed to be cleaning, not you. Damn. <laughs> Full of foolishness. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. See, I, see, you want the maid because you want to go to work. But it ain't like you don't want the woman to go to work. No, I, I, I don't want my woman to go to work. Oh, you don't? I want my woman to take care of me. Okay, and you take care of everything else. That's the way I thought. Okay. That's the way I want to do it. But y'all won't be, hear your words, independent. And that's a bull. Because y'all know y'all won't be independent. That's a word just to on us, just to say, well, I'm independent. So y'all won't go, let me tell you what y'all do. Y'all won't go to work, to work, so y'all can talk work and to complain. And get somebody else to do the work in the house. Yeah, and then, so, so. And then complain when... I don't pay the woman. You can complain to me. Oh, you you expect me to do it, and I waking hard or that? No, sit your backside home. Well, first and foremost, let me I'm say, the boss. Okay, you try and to take with my role. you being the boss, mm. Isaac Ross, it has to be. Well, it should be where well, there was you. some mm -hmm. discussion. Mm -hmm about the upkeep of the house mm -hmm. and the need for help with it, especially if the woman is working on the outside. Mm -hmm. Some people, some women, mm -hmm. literally don't enjoy housework. Well, ain't nothing wrong if you don't enjoy housework. See, see, 
you marry me, for example, right? Mm -hmm. example. My responsibility is to make sure you are happy. Okay. But so I if cannot... getting a house assistant mm -hmm. makes me happy, then what's the problem with but you paying for it? No, no. You want me pay for the maid, or the housekeeper, right? Mm -hmm. Then you won't turn around and don't want to open your leg for me too. Okay. So and then, kind of complex, hold on. Eh? So, no, because you won't be the boss. Oh. You, you won't dic see. You won't be the boss. You won't dictate to me when I, when I supposed to jump on top of you. Mm. But you want me pay all the bills. But you still want me dictate. And brothers out here, listen. I know they listen. If they listen, they get it. You won't tell me when to may open your leg. What day you open your leg? Mm -hmm. What day you feel like going over me? What day you feel like cleaning? What day you feel like cooking? See, men has complained so much about your woman because you know why men really go for sweetheart out there? Mm -hmm. Because their mind is not comfort. See, it's the I, mind. I am making ready mm -hmm. to ask you right now. Ask me all the questions. So, mm -hmm. if the woman was giving you sex on time, mm -hmm. all these other things wouldn't matter. You wouldn't mind paying for them, for, for the maid, and and if she says she don't feel like cooking that day, you'll go and buy because food if you and smart, bring it yeah, home. Because if you're smart, we will have this confrontation, who's the boss mm. in the house? If you're smart, you would play your role like the Bible says, you'd help me. you play that role. Mm. You be submissive, not fool. Don't get me wrong. I ain't talking about no fool talk. You be submissive in, in certain areas that you're supposed to be submissive mm -hmm. in. Mm -hmm. You will show me love and kindness. Mm -hmm. I will not have a problem because I feel glad to spend all my money and time and energy on you. But the problem is, is when you all show your ugly head and you all won't be the boss. So let me tell you what I do. Oh man, we pull the rug from me. That's what we call it. Pull the rug from me, is you. So yeah. we then we decided to play stingy. You ask me for a hundred dollars, I give you forty. You ask me again, I ain't got it. So the game is going on, because do you know? I had a conversation with somebody, and a woman confided in me something, and, and it's so deep when she find me. She said, I've been a Christian for 10 years. And she said, you know, as a Christian, you, you put the food on the table. You know, you, you, you do the Christian thing. You, you, you try to be somewhat submissive. But at some time, some point, you show your ugly head. You know, yeah, because it is so bad that sometimes they just be stubborn. Woman just some woman just just gotta be argumentative to get to you, get on your nerve, right? That's just basically the step you back. What I am hearing is mm. she was dissatisfied in the relationship. So after doing all the things that she normally do, then she get disgruntled because it's like I'm waiting on you, I'm being your help meet, but you still But she say for years can't satisfy. she was married for years. Mm -hmm. Praying to God. Mm -hmm. Going to church, mm -hmm. doing all the right, trying to do all the mm -hmm. right things. Mm -hmm. And she said, then she realized that all those things she was doing, the very thing that the man had desire, mm -hmm. she wasn't meeting that need. Which was the sex? Yeah. Okay. And she said, and the minute she found out that, oh, this is what he really want from mm -hmm. me. This is how he want me to be. Mm -hmm. She's a whole relationship turn around. She say, so sometimes she believes some some woman, majority of women, mm -hmm. is just stick with their gun and they don't know when to let That's, go. You know, every time we talk about that on this show, I keep saying to you, it's because we have been programmed that way well be we we see role modeling is a very serious thing you know mm -hmm. 
we don't see affection displayed in our families we see more arguments than anything mm -hmm. we see our mothers cleaning the house preparing the food taking care of the children not being affectionate or our fathers being affectionate to our mothers so there's more argument so the role of who is the boss mm -hmm. is not quite clear even though you hear it preached in the pulpit the man is the head of the home as God is the head of the church but, but mm -hmm. the reality of it and then sadly we all for some reason think that sex is dirty and even in marriage even as Christians people are having a problem with being sexually aggressive or sexually open mm -hmm. with their partner and so yeah so so when you say the woman dictating when she gonna have sex and when she gonna cook and when she gonna do whatever inside the house it comes from a place of wrong programming and also from dissatisfaction in the relationship but you can't tell majority of women today you can't tell them that kind of story you just said just now you know that's because they don't understand it the norm for us is we have to fight our way to get what we want and we keep our legs closed as a bargaining chip ah, to get what it is that we want that, in the marriage that is the key it's a woman use the sex as a bargaining chip that's it that is the key right there and that's where woman has to understand that your body is not a bargaining chip your body by the book of um, belongs to the man that's what the Bible say but you won't go to what the book say if the man would do what the book say too then it goes both ways yeah but mm. the Bible tells the man to love his wife how many men love their wife how can I love you and the very thing I want from you and giving to me? Well, hand go, hand come. One no, 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 no. Answer my question. How One person has to start. But you know, so, sadly, so Tony, you let me tell you something. Start? No, what happened? What happened? Just like I said before, the modeling within the home, mm -hmm. right? And then most men are absent. They come home at certain hours. They bully the wife. They disgruntle. They, the food is there, they throw in things and they throw in tantrums just so that they can have an excuse to exit the door after they then fill their belly. But you know why? Why do you think that happens? Why do you think men bully women? Because they think that they have the upper hand or they have no, the no, authority no, 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 no. in the home. Ah, because the woman makes the man feel that the only thing he could do to make her happy is bring money. And men mm -hmm. and men make women feel that the only thing she can do to make him happy is to give him sex. Yes. And so and that is why. So how you see that is the root so, of the problem. So we're talking about the boss. So the man, yeah, mm -hmm. feels Ooh, boss his boss ship is being challenged because the woman is taking charge by withholding sex. Right. The man think his or the woman think that the man doesn't love her because he withhold the things that makes the family flow you say she's the help meet mm -hmm. she should be home doing all the things that you mentioned but a lot of women go out because the men do not foot the bill so so let's go let's start some it. children let's start go hungry they don't have school supplies they don't have lunch money and the list goes on women go so, to help so, me so so for me being the needs the, of the children so for me to be the boss in the house i gotta put the money on the table but you know uh, what? Nothing. no no uh, no 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 the thing about me? it is and in order for the woman for, for you to really be the man she gotta open up a leg why not okay so why not why not because in either because instance, that, why but not? But that's what you're playing me, so I gotta play you tit for that. So that's why all the marriages and relationships are going to hell, like you yeah, say, yeah, in, a yeah, in a basket. Because everyone is playing the power game. Yeah, but we. 
but, but that's all I have. But let's sit down. No, 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 no. And restart. A, see, I talk about the man. That's all I have. If I notice the thing that you love, right? The only time I could fight you is to take away the thing that you love. And the only way the woman can fight you is to take away the thing you love. No. So why are you all the fighting? No, you know fighting because I go around the corner. There you go. And and round the corner might be younger, sweeter, look better. So that's why the woman go on the job, make her money, and let you go around the corner and get what you want. Because guess what? Round the corner, you still got to put money on the table. No. Round the corner, I marry you. I am responsible for you. Round the corner, just... I marry you. I'm responsible. I give her what I feel. So here it is now. Yeah. Talking about being the boss. Mm -hmm. I can be the boss around the corner. Yeah, you boss yeah. by bullying. No. You boss by 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 leveraging your money. I trading off. What the hell? I so, the boss. I trading. This is a trade game. So. You know, you whole love. Couple years ago, <laughs> you know what people started saying. It ain't about romance. It's about finance. The question is. Who start this waving thing? This yeah. this this warring yeah. thing. But see, Who started it? But see, it, it was man all... blame woman, woman blame man. But let me tell Six you, six and a half doesn't but seem. But the thing. truth is this. The truth is, and we have a discussion here. Mm -hmm. And the truth is this: both could be the boss in the house. There don't because, need to be any boss because well, yeah, nobody but, but employed be the other one. No, you but, are in a partnership. But in a relationship, you gotta have somebody. Head of it. It's a leader. It's yeah. not a boss. Okay, but the same thing. A leader. Boss. No. Okay. Boss let, let's use the word control. Different. Boss. Bully. But boss. Let's do say the everything leader. other than let's say the manage. Let's say the leader. Okay. Yes. That's the way you went. Okay. Got to be somebody to lead. But. And it doesn't have to be the man, and it doesn't have to be the woman. What I gather from this boss situation is there is a power struggle. No. Where is the love? What, what love? Exactly. Wait, wait, what love? Listen, you know, in Nassau, you think people really love anymore? Women love their children. Man, and men love themselves. Because men love to hear themselves. Women only screaming by your number. Know, man, no me checking for women when they're talking. You could row and tell the moral come. You know the fellas say? You know the man say? He tell you you go around till more I gone. But you know, that is similar to raising so, your children, you know. And but, so the key is effective communication. But see, I can break this down for you. Respect. See, behemoth woman will tell you, well, you the man. When the fella got the gun, holding up two of us. But you supposed to be the man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh your mode big when you ready to have it. <laughs> but you can okay, your mode big buy your mode buy your mode now. See. See woman gotta realize to be the protector. No 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 no. The Hold protector, on. Hold on. the provider. I bring I bring the wrong bread home. Mm -hmm. Your mode big. You go, I tell you, bring wheat bread. How you get bread? And, and you say, but hold on, I can care about. No, no, no. I, I, you wasting time because I and you run on a whole little story and you row me. Then watch this now. Chew this bread, and you got sweetheart. See, all of a sudden, <laughs> this conversation. Oh gosh. This conversation. It's but, open. It, it opened the door for all uh, the ills in the that relationship. That is woman. Your mode hard, and you and you got big mode. But when is crisis time? You stuck in the corner. See, you can't have it both ways. So, when is your time to speak loud? Is when I come home and I want you open up your leg, open your mouth and your leg at the same time. Don't mess with me. Don't play this game, but <laughs> <laughs> you hold it back. Hold back. Hey, listen, I marry you to have this in my, listen to the words I use. I marry you to have you in my home for me. For my happiness. But you won't come in my home and tell me what to do. Then you can bring your dirty, ugly children to come in the house to run me on my own house too. So I got all kind of boss going on. 
and, and your little children probably even can't spell too good, but they using big way too, and they cussing me too. So you, this, you, listen, ain't no time. Bahamian woman has to get this right. That sound like they and your children. Hey, be nice. If they if their minds are not, you know what happened? They can take their mother's side. Come on, this this is Clearly, clearly, I clearly somebody, somebody out there. Wrong. Please, somebody out there, hit somebody, me up. Somebody, <coughs> something is wrong. Somebody if out your there, hit me up. Don't have respect for somebody you. Somebody out there, hit me up to straighten this woman. Listen, you know, my man suffering as well. Men get stroke every day. Men die from heart attack every day. You know how tough y'all is? You know how much abuse y'all send us through? Wow. All right. So, y'all won't be the boss and don't know how to be humble. But y'all always won't be aggressive. So, 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 so. So many so, times you know what you do. You gotta go find sweet out of the cool. Something. Let me tell you something. That means <laughs> you presenting. Oh boy, Charlie, uh, I know you uh, hear me. Uh, you presenting a picture of Bahamian men as being spineless. So where all these women coming from would being abused by their partners? No, they abuse all their partner because they abuse their partner first. And the man get tired. Listen, you ever see, you ever go in a relationship, you, you see all these relationships? Most men, when a woman around, he ain't saying nothing. Yap, 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 and she going on, yap, 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 yap. And, and he ain't saying people, nothing. People, people, people. And so you know when abuse come? Yeah, I know he, when he say, that, right? He say, what you mean? He's going to say, he, then he turn around and say, you, that's your last way. You said not a word. So why is it that they have a women's crisis center in the Bahamas and not a man crisis center? Be, be, if it's the woman who are doing the abusing. Woman, what you mean? You abusing, woman abuse you just the way you look at you. Woman scorn is one of the worst abusive thing in the world. You see a woman look at you, like, oh, you, 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 you heard a woman look at you. So, so get that right. Let me see, somebody say something. Mm -hmm. Caffeine Bryce says no. Okay. No. Caffeine no to what though? <laughs> Tony say no to what no caffeine? No to what caffeine? He's saying, she's saying that women don't abuse men. I'm sure that's what she's saying no to. Bah, listen to me. Woman, listen. I, uh, why you think all these fellas getting killed today? These young boys. Because they're abusing women. No, because they are getting, because they're getting, cause they're getting abused. By other men, not by women. No, but women cause that. Women abuse is very serious there you go now he is thinking you that you're saying women no no are abusers. i understand what you're saying is that what you're saying what i'm what she is saying that it, you know in a yes woman when men abuse women is very serious okay okay but watch this most men mightn't say it but they get abused all the time. Well, but man, see, you know, see men, because men embarrass mm -hmm. to speak about it. And they need people like me to speak about it. They right there telling me, boy, Tony, because they know I can get the lash back. And I, I got big. Men are abusing women, she said. Yeah. But, but, but if you really, really put to text, woman you know, abusing man. Yeah, yeah. Now, so badly, because, yeah. because of what you just described Tony mm -hmm. I remember one of our viewers about two years ago asked for us to um, discuss women speaking badly to their man Cos -cos in public All now the so that verbal Cos abuse because yep. you know you have physical abuse you have verbal abuse and I guess you have withdrawal abuse where mm. you abuse them by not giving them sex mm. right you know what the bad is yeah. that may be That's that abuse. may be that is abuse. the one common no, let me, abuse let me give in you the some Bahamas abuse. Let me give you some but abuse. of course it is a ripple effect mm. from the dissatisfaction within the relationship but let me give you some abuse you want me to give you some abuse go ahead Care your black self. That's verbal. That's abuse. Mm -hmm. 
because it, it and, and then, women calling the man why are you so stupid, stupid. yeah and, right uh, and one of, and men do the same and this is my child give me this child uh, why are you talking like that yeah and that's, stop that's being abuse. my child yeah. when well, it is your yeah. child yeah and, yeah and, and don't don't and you're See, taking away the power. Now, the thing about it is, I, I'm going to say I ain't that the boss. I ain't want to be the boss in my house, you know. Let me tell you what I want to be. You want to be respected. I want to be respected. I want to be the boss. If you could run the whole house mm -hmm. with keeping me out of your business, <laughs> I good. I, I, I don't have no complex. I, I don't have no... You could... Listen, you could take the hose on top of your head and run it and do it. I ain't gotta be. I can sit in my small corner. Just open your leg when you want it open. <laughs> yeah, just don't deprive me for the things I supposed to have. And I ain't the just talking the sex. You, yeah. What else? You, what else are you supposed to don't have? Don't deprive me for my time that okay. you supposed to spend with me. Don't deprive me. He's a rare man, you know, because yeah. most men ain't looking for no time. No, don't deprive me of them children I supposed to have. But you keep telling me about uh, I ain't having a baby now. Uh, I, who, yeah, who, but who's, when, who's but, you? But who's then, you to tell me if I marry you, you have no baby? The woman could do that because guess what? Typically in the Bahamas, men do not help with the children. Okay, so the woman... When they do help, it's a big problem. So, and they might as well take their hand off because of the abuse. Yeah, so who's the boss then? It's a woman. She has a responsibility <laughs> to protect her children. <laughs> See what I said? Yes, See respect said? goes both ways. For a marriage to work well, mm. barrel laughing. Yeah, but 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 you marry me, right? I see. Yeah, 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 yeah Here's the problem, I, and this happened. A guy brought this to me, mm -hmm. attention to me. Mm -hmm. He be married five years. Okay. He ain't got no children yet. He's what happened? Well, did they go to the doctor to assess the problem? No, 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 no. The woman. No, 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 no. No, the woman controls. Is she having children? This is what's wrong Where with you. I you... ask a simple question because guess what? Men are always blaming women when they do not have children. Now, yes, in some instances, some women, but that should have been something discussed before the marriage. I don't need to discuss but that. But I what don't. The, what you mean you on, don't need on, to discuss it? On. Not all women hold, want to have children. Yeah, Beryl. Hold on. I don't need to discuss it. Anything but having children with you. Crazy. You marry me. No, 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 hold no, on, hold no, on. no. You marry me. In the Bahamas, it is taken for granted that women want children. But oftentimes, and but rare cases, there are women who wait until they launch their career before they want to start. And that is so few. The majority of children born in the Bahamas were accidents. Yeah, I agree. But why I have to ask you? Kyle. <laughs> God laughing. Yeah. Why well, I gonna ask you to have children I marry you? When when we go to <laughs> hold on, when we go to bed, your body is mine. And if you now you say to me we can plan this and uh, yeah. But this is my woman, my wife, my body. Okay. Right. So But but, yeah, but, but it what? is okay. You see? That's another biblical principle that Bahamians hold there, right? Mm -hmm. The body of the woman belongs to the man. The man body belongs to the woman. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And that's why when women go out and they meet their man in certain situations, mm -hmm. they grab him, mm -hmm. right? But it is an assumption in this 21st century mm -hmm. where the majority of young people are no longer subscribing to the letter of the Bible. Mm -hmm. They are educated, they are pursuing bigger houses, fancy cars, being able to eat, wine, and dine on a regular basis, and they see children as an expense. You always say, it's the woman who wants the children and not the men. Agreed. So women are now saying, so how you could now say the woman body belong to you when Men don't want children to start off with. They only want children when they want to lock the woman down. Yeah, but hold on. I built this big house, right? I put you in it. I got three bedrooms. You wouldn't think I planned to put children in one or two of them? That's why yeah, I built it that big. Yeah. Now, but, if I, build, but, I have you in a one bedroom, then I tell you I want no children. Okay. So, 
If the woman says she doesn't want any children, what do you do? Well, you will know what I do? Yeah, or you, do you do? will know what man do? What, you, what, what man do? Go outside man goes outside and have children. Okay. You will have none? Listen. So let me ask a question. Why are you going to be bigger than that and say, honey, you don't want no children? Get out my house. Let me bring somebody who can give me children. Because women don't go like that. They, they women no. don't go. See, women. It's y'all who woman, want the, No, the, women don't the go like that. Because woman, women don't go like that. Women go when they plan to go. So they plan everything. <laughs> they plan everything. They plan. They plan the other boyfriend first. They gotta meet a new dude and set it up. Lord they plan it. They plan. Let me tell what they plan. So you really believe they in, plan. in in what is it? It will say who ruled the world, girls. Yeah, but hold on. They plan to take half of your money and your building you're living in. Then they can. They can. Oh, you married a garland. Yeah. <laughs> They go and they, take and guess all what? your money and guess what? Take when, your land, your house, when, and everything. When women planning to leave you, mm -hmm. they give you the best set of sex. Oh, when they're planning to leave, yeah, they want you feel this when I go. Oh. You gonna miss this. You gonna miss me. But women then, gonna, but women ain't got no time to play, you know. Okay, oh, but then she planning to leave, so they ain't like she trying to yeah. keep you. So she just want to show you what she was capable of all along. And then, when but she, because you were the problem. She is moving on to bigger yeah, and better. And then, and then, and then she can find one fella who she believe got more money than you because she want you to know, I need you. You're a joker. You only keeping me back. She can send all the messages and signs. But I still say the relationship goes better when the man is in charge. Let's go back there. Okay. And the reason for that is this. is because physically... The man. Okay, Kyle. Kyle said both of us have a point. Yeah. You better you better explain that, Kyle. Physically, the man don't think and move with emotion. They move on their physical. Yeah, they're logical. Right, they're, they're logical. They, they're logical. They yeah. process yeah. things in their head and they Woman determine. Woman move because I heard nigh gone. Woman ain't thinking long term. And what's gonna happen down the road, and how we gonna develop, and where we, you see, I, 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 I don't care who. I agree with you, Sophie. <laughs> what Sophie guys say? Oh, Sophie Lord, says Sophie. it doesn't matter what a woman planning. If the man asks her to leave his house and he's serious, he can get her out of there. Sophie, I agree with you one hundred percent. Sophie, honey, you always waffling when it comes to these. Things to make men look like they weak and you're also kind. Ain't nothing kind about man. What? Nothing kind about man. You're all devious. You can't do without a man. What do you mean nothing kind about man? I say nothing kind. I ain't say nothing but doing without you all, you know. But you all ain't kind. Hold on. What do you mean being kind? You all aren't. You all selfish. Because majority of you all... And if you all ain't want a woman, or you all will torture that woman to death, she ain't have no But majority of you all... Majority of y'all get what y'all get because of the man. Old school women don't think long term. The new women think long term. Listen to me. Old school woman put a plate of food on the table. And when she put the plate of food on the table, she won that last... Old school. She won that, t that food when that man eat it. He understand I could cook and this is where you're supposed to be. All right? That's what old school women do. They sow seed. So don't, don't mix it up. And, 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 and you know what? I glad women know my case in it. Because all, all y'all women, let me tell you something. It's too long. See, men keep their mouth shut because men say, you can't talk to them. They ain't listening anyhow. And it's proven every day. Y'all don't listen. Parents saying what. nothing kind about man. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Beryl, you never had a Tony. <laughs> what you mean, nothing kind with my Barry? Beryl, mm -hmm. them children you got, man, put them there. The girls Beryl and the boys. boys. Okay, she got man picked them boys. You couldn't pick them? Man, Kyle, them. some men don't want to push the issue and be aggressive when they want a woman to leave. Some don't want to hurt them. But at the same time, 
it's not right to go behind their back and do what they want to do. But see, behind their back? Yeah. Listen. So, going out there and finding another woman and listen, cheating listen. and no. then going back home like listen, everything okay. Listen, and, and he, this coming from me. This come from me. This tough it could be, but this come from me. No, most men don't want to go there, you know. Yeah, you always say that. But the problem is, for a sanity reason, you will lose your mind, brother, if you don't go and find a little sweetie to talk to. You will lose your fucking mind. Right? <laughs> Woman will drive you bananas. <laughs> drive you to drinking. Man. That's why so many men in the bar. Listen. Bahamian women are the toughest set of women in the world. <clears throat> now, when I say tough, they tough. Bahamian that they are strong. They are strong-willed. They know what they want. They are settling for less. You. That's what he's talking about when he say tough. When you meet when you meet a foreign woman, right? And you meet a foreign woman, she don't have all. See, she don't have all these hang up. I could take her. To Wendy's and McDonald's, she all right. But him and one? Hell no. Who you taking them in? Who you taking them? You no, they want a uh, Bahamian women will go to McDonald's, Wendy's, anywhere you get them. KFC. After you done, but have a relationship with them. But no. oh, but you talking about dating? Then you can't. If you have them. a lunch date and time constraints, but you talking about special occasion at least. Why once, I can't take it to McDonald's though? Once a month. Once every two months, special occasion, well, birthday, Valentine. Yeah, women don't want you to take them to those places. Why? On those occasions. Why? Well, we out, I right? guess because everybody food, right? else. It's food. We out. What's the, what's the difference? See, let, 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 me, let, me, let, let, let me say this to you. Let me say this to you. Let me say to you all women, especially. Uh, woman will make a man happy. Mm -hmm. No doubt about it. And when a woman is good and they are in partnership with a man, you see the best of a woman. Until but you when you start see, to take them for granted. No, no, no. But when this is this. Can't, when you see can't say behaving women expensive. Very expensive. You're there right, you you're right. When you see but when guess you see what? you can they start questioning you about things they want and things they need and you kind of shying away and then you see the true color man they get ugly listen you never seen them so ugly and me him and women get ugly when they <laughs> you all ever see when their wigs off <laughs> and, hey and them lashes in there they can oh get my ugly gosh. And, and, and and let me tell you something you you all don't know and bohemian woman i love my bohemian woman but oh Jesus, don't let a human woman decide that she don't want you no more. You like dirt. Because the things that, the things she's gonna say first of all, and then the things she's gonna do. Ain't no other woman in the world gonna do it. Most women say, Let me leave this man alone. He because don't want me. Guess what? I pack up and go. Cause Not guess the human woman. Because guess what? Talk about the good that Bahamian women do that foreign women will not do. That is the thing. Come on, brother. Hold on. Come sister, on. Sister. Foreign woman will not play you for a piano. All right? Bahamian women don't play man for what a you piano. Mean? What do you mean? Only the hurting woman in the Bahamas will play man because they have given their all. And they have been steamrolled, and so therefore they say, "Not another bugger can have me for no yo-yo." For a man, see the problem we have here in in the Bahamas is Bahamian women will bring their baggage into another relationship. They never want to heal because they need finance. They find another fellow to fill that void quickly, so they carry a backside and go heal, and then come back. So if we say, "Don't come for Bahamian women." Um, Bahamian women are beautiful, wigs and lashes or not? No, 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 I, I, I say when they get ugly, I say they ain't beautiful. <laughs> and so, let, 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 me, let me say this before we get distracted. Um, 
in a relationship, there is a role for each partner to play. There is, there is a good side and there's a bad side, and there's a side in the middle that is not so good. But you have to play those roles. Ain't nobody wanna, ain't nobody today wanna bend their back and work hard for a relationship. No. And especially men, I agree, they don't want to work hard enough to keep these relationships. So they find the easy way out. Yes, I agree. But in this in these relationships, there's room for two boss. There is room for two boss. I don't like the word boss. Okay, there's room for two leader or two there is room for a partnership we talking where about, both we talking people about, have balance, equal rights, everyone have a voice. But we're talking about boss and relationship. Well, that's only a catchphrase. Okay. That, that, well, ain't a, that, that, well, that, that is an ugly okay. so what thing I'm saying, to have a boss so what I'm saying, in a relationship. Okay. So what I'm saying to you... Unless it's a working relationship. Yeah, there's room for <clears throat> both partners. But the, each partner has to know their role and know where they will end. And guess what? And guess and what? There is no set role. That role is established between the partners. So what happening over in that relationship doesn't reflect what is happening in our relationship. Hey, sister, we agree. Hey, sister, I agree with that. Listen to what I can say. See, because man in charge of relationship. Man supposed to be in charge. And a woman want a man to be in charge. So you gotta have a somebody in charge. And the man want the woman to be in charge of his home. No, no. We don't want to Yes, you no. all do. We only want you to be in charge of our children. <laughs> <laughs> we want to be in charge of our children. And I do hope... all the work in the house, so that's being in charge. Listen, listen. I could cook. I could clean. Again. Hold on. I Hold on, wait, wait, let me finish. A special and rare specimen. And I can also please myself sometimes if I want. Okay. Yeah, right. Okay. So so I efficient. Both ways. <laughs> so so listen, and me being efficient, I don't need really a woman. I just need somebody to compliment me. To be a partner with me. Mm -hmm. I don't need you to come to be my mother. I I that's why I leave my mother house. I, I there's two of us here trying to work this out exactly that's what don't come and the woman don't need a father don't bring your mother habits to my house and Beryl say don't bring your baggage a lot of men is bring past hurt and garbage from other relationships and don't know how to let go when you come come with a clean slate and you'll have a beautiful experience let me ask you a question go ahead and y'all is and y'all is sweet at us who am I? Well, talk to me now. Hello. After y'all then uh, lie and don't tell the woman you're nah, married. Nah, bull, bull, bull. They, then y'all, y'all, y'all no. either you get found out no. when somebody see you together that's and the say. That's olden days. That's today. No, today. That is still no. today. No, today. Men are still lying no, today I, about their marriage status. Need, you don't need to lie today. Let me tell you why. why. Let me tell you why. Because the world has changed. No, the world ain't changed. Yeah, the let me world is still the no, same. No, the world. Let me tell you the world change. People changed. of the world change. People change. Let me tell yeah. you. People in the world change. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you what they tell you. What? Don't tell me about her. Tell me what. But me and you, what you can bring to the table for me and you? I ain't checking for her. I don't like woman. That's what they tell you. Ah. This. Re this a real show. We don't play. You know, buying corner here. Do you come well, straight Well, you see now, ladies and gentlemen. Come the corner. You so, get it straight from Tony they, because Tony is a man. He yeah. know what the women say. Why would you talking about her like she's she I, ain't never I ain't into her, into you. I right? looking at me. Mm. I doing me. Get, mm. I looking me. But guess what? All women that are watching this show will tell you what even is that, that is a lie because they only want their foot in the door and they'll make your life a living hell because all women want the same thing. No. All women want the same thing. No. Okay. No. Well, guess what? The new trend. The only set who don't want the same thing is them who have Tom for the light bill, Harry for the hairdresser, Dion for the for the for the, for the nail parlor, and Harry 
or I didn't call Ari yet. The next Ari for the grocery bill. But that's bill. not true. In the Bahamas today. So they independent women who self-sufficient, all they want is to stick. Yeah. They lie. They lie. No, I, I tell you, there, there's some who rather take you because you married because they don't have to take all that baggage from you. Yeah, but they also want some of your money. Then but, but, they they but, want, but then but, of it, course, what it does is it give you the leverage uh, to determine how much money you can give exactly. up. Exactly. Because then when you have the wife, you got to put all on the table. Yeah, but see, no, 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 no. You, you, where you been? Trust me. Where you, you been? Me? You, you, you better stop me. sitting in the chair, you know. Whether it's old school or Most present men. school, all women want the same thing. Most men today, most women today, they don't, it's most of them, but no, no. some of them, self, some of them only want, you. they don't want to take on a husband. That's too much work. They want the wife keep that. Tell they, they start only, getting their feelings. They only want them. Tell they start getting in their feelings. Yeah, later down the road they might get in the feelings. Because right. they get attached. So therefore, what I'm saying to you is they only lie and they lie into you and they lie into themselves. But some don't want to have that. They, they done being married before. They done had to, they don't want to get anymore. All they want you just to do, come, do you do, go. But do, guess what? Guess what? Oh, let me tell guess you what? They tell you. ain't no church going Bible toting women. No, but well, guess what they tell you? They ain't no church going Bible toting Bahamian women. That's who they is. No, hell no. The majority of them is that. Mm -mm. Well, they, they passed the need to get, you need, no, to, you no, need to find out what the Bible church. told you. Listen what the Bible told you. Seven women after one man. Exactly. They hold on, wait, want wait. nothing. They only want the name, though. They exactly. want the name. But hold on. Let me tell you the Bible also tell you. Mm -hmm. Don't forget, the Bible told you that women, right, mm -hmm. in the last days, mm -hmm. will what? You go ahead. I, right. I Unless it's something other than what I already said. No, you said it. You say seven <laughs> to one, right? But the Bible also told you that they come in for your name. The Bible, mm -hmm. the Bible, the Bible sets you up with all these things. He told you in the last days these things happen. These things gonna happen. Women, they can be more biased, more sellers than buyers, right? Okay. Okay. See these certain things about. And 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 and, and but it still only could be one boss, and that's the man. Yeah. And 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 these women can be selling their body. <laughs> that's what they're doing now. The Bible tells you this. See, so you the man is man. the boss. So at the end of the day, the man pay out here, pay out there, pay out there. Pay out the next so what they have for themselves. Where is your sense? Men don't need of... nothing for themselves. Men are fools. Okay. Some of them, some of them are fools. I did ask where the sense yeah. is. Some of them just are fools. They just they just work to party, to go in the bar. Have a fun. Have a piece of uh, leg. Yeah. Go home uh, and, and go, go to home. sleep. And go sleep. Wake up, go to work. Have because, food. Be eat their food. Have a piece of leg. Go to bed. But you know why? Wake up. Eat their food, work, have a piece of leg, but you know eat why? again, and go you know to why? bed. And you know why? Why? What a boring because life. Because like when you man. die, you ain't care nothing. When women die, they didn't care anything? They think so. Oh. Women care all them jewelry. They care all them, them, all them bags. They can plan to care all the wigs. You ever mm. see how the woman travel? Child, I got my expensive phone. They put everything in the bag. They put, they put their wigs in. They care. Women care all the makeup. They care all that in the grave. See, man don't know when he die, he ain't carrying nothing. <laughs> so he can enjoy his life. Woo! See, the problem we have in this Bahamas is that we live a life of lie. And life... Because I just say I'm coming out your mouth just now yeah. when it comes to women and what they want and what they yeah. want. Yeah. Trust me. Yeah, and, and, and see, we tell a lot of lies, we never speak the truth. What delusional, is, that's yeah. what it is. What, is, what is so sad, what is so sad that we believe, some of us believe, some women believe they can live forever, you know. I thought that was a man thing. No, women with passion street don't speak to you because they're cute. I ain't speaking. And then they tell you, if you if you find out down the road they know you and they know you, mm -hmm. you know what they say? Child, you know I can't say much because you know these men don't never stop. They, you hear them, they think that's you. Listen. Men that know they don't fool them kind of woman, cause those kind of women got a married man, and they ain't a give front. You gotta pay for that. So man ain't fooling with them. Good. <laughs> Mess with me.
caffeine said something very real and as a nurse working in the hospital I got a test to that you know what she say? What she say? It's all good for y'all men until y'all get old and need someone to take care of y'all and she say she hope that the woman you go run into is the one who can take care of you Nine. because the boring woman who wouldn't open a leg and you go around the corner, the next one is the same one who, dun, 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 misses such and such. We are calling from such and such a place. Your husband is here. We need you to come. I agree with you 100%. Now, now, now one person I agree with is all because it's been proven. I see it all the time. I go carry food now and then, some little bag of food now and then to some fellas. They live by themselves. And if their former wife, listen to the words I use, their former wife, the wife that they marry, had they children with the first, the first wife? The don't, only wife. Yeah. No, sometimes they get two, but only the, the old one. No, 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 no. I'm telling you. There's, there's divorce, their first wife? No. Because if they're in divorce, hold on, hold on, that's on, the only hold wife. On, hold on. You're talking about their girlfriend. No. Hold on. There's divorce, the first wife, go marry again, and the only person you see come and clean these dudes and take care of these dudes are the first wife. That's right. The and the only old, wife. And listen, what does bug me? What does bug me? The children is come and tell them, wife, you better go get daddy and bring daddy <laughs> And And I'd be so, I'd be shocked about but this. But guess what? You better believe in it. Don't be all the children. Sometimes it is be one kind-hearted son or one kind-hearted daughter. Caffeine says she's a nurse and she see it Caffeine. in her 40 years of Caffeine. nursing. And it, you so right because I see when I leave from here I go into somebody to, to drop something off and you ain't like with, with these old men they run the game so long until they game play out. Now they got sugar, stroke, pressure, this stuff. And, and, and nobody checking with them. And you know what they do with them? Let me tell you what they do with them. Put them in these homes. Good Samaritan. If only they would home. put them in a home. Some of them leave them right there to occupy yeah, a hospital bed. That's eventually people like me have to go put them in a home. In the hospital well, what I'm saying, right? What, what, what I'm saying is it's so sad. You're so right. See, I don't understand why is... What, what I don't understand why men, some men, take their hard-earned money and develop these women now and you see why the, the woman day, need to be the boss. And at the end of the day, see, the only thing you got for your boss is your penis in your hand. That's your boss. But your boss run out. Your money gone. Time and everything. Your penis ain't raising no more. So you, you, the woman don't need you no more. And she's still young and looking good. Yeah, because we some of, I tell and you And the young boy is seeking after them. Yeah, but some is a fool. But, but. In a relationship, as human beings and as behemoths, we got to learn to get along and we got to learn to decide for right which role we can have. I'm not saying that we should go out and um, have sweetheart because that's not the answer. They all, tongue and teeth is fight all the time. Uh, and so. We, 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 some words we say to one another and some things we do, you ain't gonna like it. But we gotta find a way to stop fighting this two boss and the host can't get along. Mm -hmm. and, and, and it's too long, um, women and men, especially in the Bahamas, butt heads in the house. And I don't, there's no reason for this. So if me and Melanie married tomorrow, there's a, there's a role for two people to be in charge. Because you could be in charge of my children. You could take care of my home when I'm not around. But when I come home... <laughs> I take over. <laughs> no, when I come home, you got to show that respect to me. Oh, okay. I might even want nothing else, you know. I just want to know when I'm home and I speak to my children. And I say to my children, uh, No, I don't want you to go out tonight. Or if you go out, come back 12 o'clock. Don't deserve my... Don't come behind my back and tell them, oh, they're young, let them go. See, because let me tell you something. 
Because when you don't do that now and you embarrass me in front of my children, mm -hmm. you take away my you take away yeah. my manhood. Yeah. And when you take away my manhood, that's a problem. Because now you know what the problem is? The children stop respecting me. And once they stop respecting me, it can reflect in the house and we can have a problem. And Michelle it can create. Say, nah, you're talking, Uncle Tony. Oh, Michelle. <laughs> Sweetie pie. <laughs> and so when we have Oh, I can get to this. You know I can get to this. I gotta get to the right part. So when we have this happening and this clash goes on, I'll say this, and I know you're a woman ready to beat me up. I think a woman should know when to bow down sometimes. I, I, I believe the woman should know the humble side of the... See, I believe the, the woman should keep me humble. Because most time the woman has the tendency and how the way she handle situation in the house, she get things done more softer than the man. And so I might be harsh, but her kind word and her loving spirit get me. And then I I I, I got easy the corner because I can now realize I got something special. But what has happened? The woman always wants to put up this fight. You know, they don't tell me, and, and they, their voice got to be bigger than yours in the house. Now, my friend outside, yeah, my wife, more bigger than mine. That being awake, because my ego getting, yeah, that can't work. All the neighbors and everything. Yeah, so that yeah. can't work. Because you know what they can they say? say? Who wear the pants in that yeah. house? You know who wear the pants and in then, that house? And then, my neighbor, and will come and take over my wife because he's like, oh, that's a joke in there. I could... He'll come. show you how to handle Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I can teach a woman. I can teach that woman over there how to, a real man. Mm. So, so all this has to do, all this fighting and fighting and all this. And what our, what our real, real topic is based on, there could be two boss. It could be easy and simple. If each partner know their rule, my role, for me, for me, is to take care of my wife. And I believe my wife's role is support me in not everything, most things I do. And the beauty of that is when she support me, I will love her more and I give her more. And she get, she get my heart because I realize, and, and men brag, let me, let me tell you all something. Men brag about their woman, you know. When a woman do good, it's a boy that woman cook on soup. That was so bad. <laughs> that was so bad. Listen. And then men also talk with their woman. Let me tell you what they say about their woman. Say, oh, that old woman tried to kill me last night. <laughs> men, men, men brag. See, men brag when their woman do good. So it's best a woman continue doing good. I know I say some things earlier that might have seems off to y'all, but ain't off. This is happening in relationships here in the Bahamas. So we, and most Christians believe everything's supposed to be pretty. That's a lie. That's a fact. Because Jesus went in the church and break up the whole church inside. <laughs> so, 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 so there's sometimes you have to, yeah, there's sometimes you have to get aggressive and you're strong. But I want you to know, and I'm going to wrap up now, and I can let Melanie. No, you can finish it. Whatever you say is the end. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And and so what? So make sure it's right though. No. Because <laughs> then I got to rebut. See if I might. See, 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 see. See if I might. See, 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 see. Two boss. See, see. See, see. She doesn't want rule. You all see what I talk about a woman. They can't give me much. Five minutes. <laughs> but, 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 but I believe in the middle of the two boss, love is the key. You know, I, I you know, I got love. You know, I, you know, I like love, love, love. and unity. Love and unity. That's yeah. the key. Mm -hmm. So when, so you men, I speak to you today. When you, um, I understand when the woman raise her voice, you don't raise yours too, because they ain't getting nowhere. Two, all, all you're doing is stressing both of you all out for no reason. Mm -hmm. So I believe, I'm talking to the men now. So what I would like for you to do, the coming new year, is that, Think before you talk. Be more loving. It will it, it, it will pan out. We got some beautiful women in the Bahamas. I know 
because I had about a hundred of them. So I know. <laughs> so I know. And I just say that to say this. When I was younger, I, I was a left, I was a lieutenant. And let me tell you the words before I go what I say. Don't tell me that loud because I want them here. That's what I can say. And I want them to struggle for this. I used to juice them and say, I could juice all and let God sort of the rest. <laughs> so, I can say, oh Lord. Thank God for change. Thank hey, listen, God for change. But listen, I can't. Only God can judge you. So I can leave you to God. I can I can't. I, that's the truth. Ladies and gentlemen. For that love. <laughs> thank you for joining us. And we look forward to sharing with you again next week. Same time, same place. And any topic you want us to take up, hit us up. Let us know what you want. If you have any problems in your relationship, you just tell us what you want to take on. And we'll take it on. Mel and Tony, Under the Tree, every Saturday, 4 o'clock. Right here in the beautiful island of Nassau, Bahamas. We bring it live to you, straight up, uncut. Have a good day. Have a good week. Bye-bye now. Enjoy. <laughs>